How you doing everyone? Joe Warlock here. It's unboxing time again. This time, Z-Box. March edition. Z-Box, 19 99 in the UK with postage and packaging. And the theme for this one is Anarchy. Now it said Anarchy is uh, Mr. Robot and Dread and other things. I can't remember, but at least I remember the theme this month. So that's pretty good, I think. So yeah, let's get straight into it. Anarchy, Anarchy, Anarchy. Ooh, ooh. I've seen the t-shirt. The t-shirt is the first thing, and I like it already. Simple enough, it's a Mr. Robot t-shirt. F-Society, the group of hackers from Mr. Robot. If you haven't seen Mr. Robot, it is well worth watching. Very mind-bending, takes a bit of getting into, but really good. I haven't even seen the second season yet, and I really should. But that is a lovely t-shirt. I'm going to hold that up again so you can actually see the detail on that. That is very cool. Yeah. That is a nice t-shirt, not going to complain. As always, about a tenner. Let's keep going, and the next item is... Ah, this is the one they mentioned. And it's very cool. It's Deathstroke, and it's one of the X-Ray versions. X-Ray. There you go. And I think this is like an exclusive painted version, so that's kind of cool. We should probably put him on the spinny disc of joy and see what he looks like. So here we have the X-Ray figure of Deathstroke. Never had an X-ray figure, but this looks so cool. I'm gonna to have to take him out of the box in a minute, but even the packaging is cool. I love the fact it's see-through, and even the detail on the box. Deathstroke X-ray. Very, very nice. So here is Deathstroke the Terminator. That looks horrifying, like literally horrifying, but it's awesome. Look at his liver and his spleen, his intestines, and all his other bits. Very, very weird. I don't know whoever came up with this idea, but you are very broken in the head, but it's cool. Loving the armor, you the red eyes, the paint job is stunning, and I love the fact they actually put his weapon in. That's kind of cool. And on the back, his sword, which he goes around pretty much just slaying people with. That's awesome. I, yeah, I can't say anything bad about these figures. I wanted an X-ray figure for ages. I've never had one. I'm just really happy I've got this one. It's going to have to go on display because it is so, so cool. No complaints about this whatsoever. I love that. I've spoken about Deathstroke before. He's a very cool character. Deadpool is pretty much just a rip-off of him, but a really good rip-off, so we won't complain. That is a very nice item. I don't know how much. I'm going to go for another tenner, probably. Kind of cool. Next out. Eh, yeah, badges. Not a huge fan of badges, as you know. But there's a whole bunch of badges. Like, literally. Can't even get them all up. I should probably zoom in so you can see all these. So, the Doom badges. And you can see they are actually some really cool and very detailed badges. So if you're a Doom fan, you may well like them. That's actually kind of cool. I like them. I'm never going to use them though. But still very cool. The new Doom game was awesome. Reminded me of the old one. Just absolute chaos. Loved it. Kind of hope to make a sequel. Just not a bad one. Or maybe leave it as it is. I don't know. What did you think of the Doom game actually? But yeah, they're actually quite nice badges. I'm just not a fan of badges. Uh, I don't know how much badges go for. Probably four quid or something. Maybe something. I don't know. Another item. It's Judge Dredd. Oh, I like this. Anyone who knows me or has seen my channel previously knows I like Judge Dredd. And we have his helmet on a stand. The Judge's helmet. So, so cool. The Dredd film, uh, in my opinion, was awesome. I'm going to take this straight out of the package. But um, yeah, it didn't get the love it deserved because it's an amazing film. Instead, we got a whole bunch of, like, Taken films and other rubbish that did not need sequels, like The Fast and the Furious. Why? Why does it need eight or nine or ten? Make a new Dread film. That was awesome. Yeah, this is actually really quite nice. Yeah. It's not the heaviest thing. It's uh, sort of plastic. But it's very cool. The visor. One thing I hated in the Stallone film was you saw him in his helmet, then he took it off, and that was that. Dread doesn't take off his helmet. What's the deal? Also, 2080 Dread stickers. Kind of cool. It's the 40th anniversary of 2080 as well, which is insane. I've been reading that since I was a kid. I know, I'm not 40, but anyone who's anyone probably has read 2080 or Dread's Dread at some point. Or maybe just me. I don't know. Let's keep going. Next out of the box, we have... Oh, this is different. They used to print the t-shirt on the box. Now, they've put it on a poster. 
That's kind of cool. I like that. So not only do you get the t-shirt, but you get a poster of what's on the t-shirt. Because some of these prints that you get on the t-shirts are really cool. Again, F Society. I like that. You know what? I really like this box. I know the badges aren't really my thing, but everything else is really cool. That's uh, one more item, and it's the book. Anarchy book. F Society. Let's take a look. Z-Box Magazine Anarchy. I love the logo. That's a cool poster and a cool t-shirt. Very nice. Top quality on that one. Uh, B for Vendetta. If you haven't seen that film, need to watch it. Such a good film. So first things, the Z-Boxes. All you lot who have put some effort into taking pictures of all the stuff you got. The last box was very cool with all the bombshell stuff. Really like that. That's my picture. That's even better. <laughs> right, keep going. Can you keep the peace? Oh, it's all about... Oh, it's a question on if you could be the mayor of Gotham City. That's weird. Screening Anarchy, Fight Club. Oh, there's Mr. Robot. That's the face. Very cool. Geek t-shirts. He's awesome. Elliot and Mr. Robot. Can't remember the name of the actor. Ah! Forgot his name again. But yeah, he's very, very cool. What's in the Z-Box? All the stuff you got in the Z-Box. Very nice. Politics and superheroes. What's your D&D &D alignment? Ooh, Dungeons and Dragons. There's actually quite a lot. Oh, I like this. They've started adding in like how they actually do the t-shirt designs, which is a really cool little addition. I like that. I'll actually have a read of that because I love arty stuff. Threads, uh, unboxed that recently. That was a really cool box. Ooh, first box, only $4.99 with the code Threads. Not bad, how can you refuse that? Judge Dredd versus Doomguy. Le Magazine, something or other in French. Ooh, and next month, genius. I don't know what's going to be in that box. That's a unique theme. I like it. I really like that box, actually, so that was really good. Let's go through all the items and just see what we got. F Society poster. The same graphic you get on the t-shirt. I like that. I don't know if that'll be a regular thing, but I would quite like it to be, because the t-shirt designs are awesome, and if I can get a poster of them, I'm happy with that. That's cool. The Judge Dread helmet, which is very nice. I've just realised the stickers actually go on the uh, stand for the helmet. That's cool. Love Judge Dread. Yeah, that's just... I, it's it's nice. I like it. That's what more can I say? Doom badges. They're actually nice badges, but they're not for me because I don't really wear badges. I did when I was like in college and I was a skater and all that kind of stuff, but not anymore. But they're still pretty decent. Four quid or so. I don't know what the helmet goes for. Eight quid, something like that. A very cool X-ray Deathstroke. Never had an X-ray figure. Always wanted one. They're creepy as, but that is so nice. I really like that. That's. Pretty much half the value of the box in that figure, I think. Le book of all the stuff in the Anarchy book. That is cool. And a very sweet t-shirt. I really, really like the t-shirt. F Society, indeed. Very cool. I need to watch season two of Mr. Robot. At least I think I do. Is it any good? Let me know. All in all, yeah, I said before, but I really like this box. But I want to know what you think, guys. So, what do you think of Z-Box? What do you think of the theme Anarchy? What was good? What was bad? What could they have done better? Let me know in the comments below. As always, guys, if you fancy grabbing yourself a Z-Box, I will leave a load of discount codes and links down below. So thank you for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that like button because it really helps me out. And if you're new here, why not subscribe? Because why not? You might find something you like. In the meantime, though, and most importantly, be happy, be free, keep it awesome. And I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.